Hey guys. Hello there. How you doing? I hope you're good. I'm Thomas, this is Tech Productions, and you are watching episode 19 of Tech Tuesday. This week I give a sneak peek at some of my old LEGO Star Wars sets, discuss the future largest LEGO set, and I host my first live stream contest. How about that news? This is Tech News. There have been rumours this week that the 2017 Millennium Falcon might not be the biggest ever LEGO set for much longer. Rumour has it that set 10276 will be an 18 plus Roman Colosseum that will be on shelves for November. The piece count? Sit down for this one. 9,035 LEGO elements. That's crazy to me that LEGO are going this big on a set and it is very intriguing what price point this will hit. All the people who care about price per piece I'm sure will still find a way to complain about this set being so overpriced. It's tricky to say at this stage, but I think this is going to be a beautiful LEGO set. It has to be with all those pieces, right? I can't see it being something that I end up purchasing though. No Mail Monday this week, but as a lot of you know I'm in the process of moving at the moment and I went up into the old playroom digging out all my old LEGO. Um, and yeah, I found this, which is a 2013 advent calendar that is actually uh, not been opened. So uh, I've listed it on my eBay because I'm not really fussed for the figure, but if it doesn't sell, uh, the Django Fett is pretty cool and I'll probably then go back and try to collect all the Christmas figures. Um, but yeah, I'm not going to get all of this out, but I do just want to give you guys that are newer to the channel a, uh, a look at what some of this might be. So, I mean, I can't remember what's in here, a lot of it, so. Uh, got an X-Wing poly bag. I think that was from, like, the Daily Mail or something back in the day, but. Um, we've got an AAT there, the older one. We've got the Malevolence down there that's very dusty. Oh, we've got my old Republic Cruiser. A couple of Naboo Starfighters. Uh, a couple of Battle on Naboo car droid carriers. What else have we got in here? We've got some Swamp Speeders, Vulture Droids, Corporate Alliance Tanks, Separatist Shuttle, some uh, Geonosis Cannons there. Uh, a leg of my 8080, which uh, I'm glad that's there because I did wonder where that got to <laughs> when I was looking at the other one. Um, when I was looking at my one in the other box, sorry. Um, yeah, like I said, I don't want to drag too much of this out. I think a lot of this is my droid army stuff. Yeah, another couple more corporate alliance tanks there. Some staps in there as well. Geonosis fighters. So, yeah, I can't wait to get all this out. Um, I'm currently designing some wardrobes. Um, and, yeah, I will hopefully get them built uh, in the next month or so when, uh, when I'm all moved in. So, yeah, look forward to getting all this out, dusting it off and having it properly displayed. Tech Tuesdays just rendering off iMovie and then I can get that uploaded. Um, I've just been playing about with Hedwig. I think this is so cool. I'm a really, really big fan. Um, and the piece that I thought was an extra that I couldn't find anywhere, it was actually uh, meant to go there. Instead of that piece there, I put one of these um, quarter cylinder or quarter round tiles. So I had that on there instead. Um, so yeah, so I fixed that and it's all good. But yeah, this is awesome. Love this set. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Can't wait to uh, have this on a, in a nice display cabinet somewhere. <laughs> so cool. So I just premiered Tech Tuesday. It's quite late because uh, I was notified quite early on by Ollie that uh, I had ruined the video again. I don't know what it was. It, something happened out of iMovie that it kind of corrupted the end of the file and then I uploaded it because I didn't check it because I'm stupid um, and yeah it caused problems so I took it down from YouTube um, I had to re-export it from iMovie, re-upload it, internet's been so slow um, and the quality was just awful, it was in like 3, 360p because uh, I don't think the HD uh, cut has finished um, has finished processing on YouTube. It was right on the wire, is it? Yeah, so it's quite late, but thanks to everyone, Dan and Paige, Guava King, Brick Clicker, Fox, all uh, stopping by the chat. I really appreciate that. Um, and yeah, it's quite cool to see these premieres, so I might might make it a semi-regular thing when there's, uh, when there's maybe something fairly substantial going on in one of the videos, but yeah, 
I won't do it all the time because I think then it loses its kind of uh, uh, uniqueness and kind of special feel to it. But yeah, no, it's fun. So yeah, thanks for hanging out, everybody. Just done a test stream with my fam for the Speed Build Sunday Live Challenge. It's going to be happening, obviously, on Sunday. First one this week. So, yeah, just thought I'd get practicing. This is the leaderboard. James Page, Dan, Sam, and then Amy. Um, and they all built the pug from the 3-in-1 Creator Poly Bag. Uh, it's a cool little pug. It's quite cute, to be honest. Uh, so, yeah, that was that. But, yeah, it uh, definitely gave me some insight of how to run it, how to run it a bit better. Got some feedback at the end as well, so... Yeah, I'm looking forward to doing that stream. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. And I hope uh, plenty of people partake and, uh, yeah, enjoy it as well. For a quick ad break now. On Sunday, August 16th at 8pm British Standard Time, I'll be joined by CB Bricks and Guava King for Speed Champions Speed Build Sunday Live. I'll pop a card on the screen right now so that you can go over and set a reminder. And we look forward to having you guys come and hang out. So the last few weekends, going and get those LEGO Star Wars sets and then the Osprey, hunting for that. Last few weekends have been pretty busy, so I realised uh, my subscription feed was full of videos that I've been wanting to watch, um, but just haven't got around to and haven't got the time with us uh, moving out as well in the next couple of weeks. Been kind of uh, prepping for that as well, selling some stuff. So yeah, haven't really had that much time to uh, sit and uh, watch some of the videos. So I've just got a big old fat playlist uh, queue going there some videos I am building a set but uh, I'm not gonna let you guys know just uh, just now here what set it is if you've been watching the channel and uh, you see the video it would have probably come out a day later probably would have come out Saturday instead of Friday you'll know what I'm talking about but if you don't then I will put a card on the screen to go to that video and uh, yeah you can see what I'm building it's it's worth going over there and checking out if you haven't seen it I promise Star Wars content of the week. Thumbs up for my beautiful singing voice. So it's Saturday morning and I'm just having a lazy day in bed. Lazy morning, watching some Rebels. Uh, it's cool to see some of these characters um, develop their story from the Clone Wars. Obviously like Gar Saxon and uh, yeah, it makes more sense now having had the Clone Wars um, what happened and stuff. So yeah, I'm really enjoying these Mandalore Rebels episodes. I'm glad that they've gone into detail about it but yeah so just enjoying that and yeah having a lazy Sunday morning Saturday morning sorry Saturday morning <laughs> so I thought I had all the stop motion all recorded for the mall collection and uh, I can't find it anywhere it's so annoying I've got last uh, last the first episode's one but not the second and I haven't got a script that I can just overlay on the first one so that's really annoying so I'm gonna have to leave the stop motion out on that because it's nearly half five on Saturday. The video should have been out at five o'clock yesterday, so I just need to get it out. It is good, regardless of not having the stop motion. It's annoying that it's not going to have the stop motion, but yeah, um, better than nothing, I guess, but very frustrating. <laughs> Once again, I forgot to do a little intro before the uh, speed build this week, but uh, yeah, I was just rushing around and getting ready for the stream. A bit different this week because we had the first speed build Sunday live challenge, um, which was really fun. Congratulations to CB Bricks. He absolutely smashed the rest of us. So he will be getting a £20 Amazon voucher and that will be on the way to him this week. And uh, yeah, it was really, really good fun. Everyone took part, the, uh, wanted to, it was really good fun. Um, and yeah, there seemed a few people in the chat, um, Sean and Brick, uh, Brick Clicker and a couple of others were all, all seem keen to come on and do it again. So I think next month, um, I think I might do it maybe like the first Sunday of every month, um, I think is going to be the is going to be the plan. So um, yeah, I think I'm going to do the Trolls poly bag as well. Trolls for lols, I think I call it, <laughs> something like that. But yeah, uh, so it's a lot of fun. And uh, yeah, you can go back and watch the stream. I'll put it in my playlist. Um, I'll unlist it on YouTube, but it will be on the playlist at the bottom of my channel. So if you want to go check that out, it was a lot of fun. Um, but yeah, congratulations to CB Bricks. Thanks for watching this week's Tech Tuesday. 
Make sure you leave a comment, give a like or a dislike, whatever you fancy. I'm Thomas, this is Tech Productions. Thanks guys, see you next time. Oh, before you go, if you enjoyed this video, how about clicking that subscribe button right here. Catch last week's episode of Tech Tuesday up there, or if you fancy something different, try this one. See you next time.